Whether you're an architect, a designer, or any other type of creative professional, the projects you work on can be challenging. One of the reasons for that is something you might not even be aware of, value conflicts, like client demands that don't align with user wishes, or amazing projects for petty cash. How do you deal with value conflicts like these? Where do they come from? Let's have a look at your business model. In its most basic form, a business model is quite simple. You have a product on offer, your value proposition. With this product, you create value for your customer, use value, like shelter from the rain. And in exchange, you capture value yourself by receiving payment from that customer. But in practice, it's a bit more complex. You offer different products or services in each project you work on. Plus, you have to deal with the use values of many stakeholders, such as clients, users, and governments. And the way you can capture value from a project isn't limited to profit. Professional values like status, your own development, and work pleasure are also important for you to capture. Value conflicts can arise in both the value creation and the value capture parts of your business model. Say your client wants to work with the cheapest possible materials, whereas the more expensive option would be way better for the environment. That's a conflict in use values. Or a client offers a large payment for a project you find ethically unacceptable. A conflict between financial and professional values. At TU Delft, we've developed a toolkit to help you design the business model for your projects and to make well-informed decisions on how to deal with value conflicts. Through a structured process of steps, you'll identify important use values, financial and professional values for your project. You'll prioritize these values based on your expertise and the risks involved in your project. Then you'll decide on how to secure these values by picking the right project partners, planning your activities, setting up collaboration agreements, and putting a revenue model in place. Ready to take control over the value conflicts in your design project? Go to our website and download the toolkit.